Here at Colfax and Broadway, the 99% have returned to this epicenter of local culture. And the young and the old, the rich and the poor, people of all socioeconomic backgrounds have collectively come together here to call bullshit on Wall Street, the corporations who have sold us out while they got bailed out, and the president who apparently can't hear us. Um, why do you march today with the 99%? Because I am the 99%. I am one of the 99%. News, we're, we're in this together. We are the 99%. The only way we're going to fix all of our problems is for everybody to get involved. What they attempted to do first was push us out of the park and say, don't get arrested, just go home. But I said, 2,000 people won't show up in the streets tomorrow if I don't get arrested for doing nothing. The U.S. consumes an awful, awful lot of the world's resources, and I think we're learning that that's not sustainable. What can we do as ordinary citizens? to uh, bring something to the table. It's more than just one single issue. The police, the authorities, they're in this, whether they know it or not, we're all a paycheck or an injury away from being in the same boat. They need to make the corporate banksters responsible for ripping the American people off. We are the 99%. That's why we are here as veterans, to represent the 99% that get pulled to go fight their wars. And I am so heartened to see the young people who have the stamina to do it, like I did then, coming out and representing. Basically, the only reason I'm out here is to feed the 99%. Um, we're operating a free kitchen. Uh, we lost one a couple days ago, so we're back at it. I'm here in solidarity. We change our hearts. We stop the greed. And um, yeah, so I can, you know, change the world for my girls.